Isle Palms, located just outside of Charleston, South Carolina, is an enjoyable beach. It's a very family-friendly beach. It's not a real boisterous type of place. It's one where you really enjoy spending the day. It has its typical amenities, souvenir shops, restaurants, and other things like that. Uh, however, you won't find many national chains there, but uh, you'll find plenty of choices to your liking. Uh, we spent the day there in March. Um, and as you can see, the weather was just simply gorgeous. They had a great playground area. Our son loved playing there, and it was really yards from the beach. Had a volleyball area if you'd like to play with your family or friends. And the beach itself was clean. It was nice. It was really well kept. However, the sand was very hard and very compact, and um, it wasn't as... Uh, uh, loose as uh, some of the other beaches but you could walk for miles and there wasn't a, any hotels it was definitely just pure residential and any hotels you did see were not high-rise hotels and uh, they had a great deck area uh, where you could walk and play and they had a little lookout uh, that you could just uh, you know peer out into the ocean for miles and the uh, plenty of showers and changing stations that were really clean well kept um, somebody somewhere you could take uh, young kids to and not have to worry about and as you can see here uh, Ash and I sat and played on this deck for uh, quite some time and again middle of March and it was a sunny blue sky and and really breezy and again just one of those places that you'll really enjoy going to if it's really about the family uh, the key though too on on a side note here is when we went it was, it was out of season, so there was virtually no people there. However, we've heard that it gets extremely crowded in the summertime and uh, hard to find parking. And that's just something to note um, when you're planning on visiting there. And, you know, it depends on what you want. But, again, um, Isle Palms is a place that uh, we would recommend you visiting and it's worth checking out. And on another side note, dogs are welcome. Uh, we didn't take our dogs on this trip. But from what we understand is uh, during the off season, you're actually allowed to have them off the leash and let them run the beach and you won't have any problems there. And that's, you know, for dog lovers, that's something that uh, is very, very appealing. So again, Isle of Palms, make sure you put it on your one tank trip list. We would give this uh, at least a half a tank. It's totally worth going to. Um, if you're in the area, especially, you have all your choices, Folly Beach, um, Sullivan's Island. And uh, we say, hey, if you got some time and you want to head out, go check out Isle of Palms. We look forward to seeing you out on your next one tank trip.